In 1861, at the age of 24, John embarked on his own financial journey, founding his own company, which also served as an agent for his father's bank in England. During the American Civil War, John found an opportunity to profit. While avoiding military service, he engaged in war profiteering, making substantial gains. He revolutionized the American railroad system, employing a strategy known as Morganization to consolidate small railroad companies into powerful conglomerates under his control. He went on to own one-third of all American railroads. But John didn't stop at railroads. In 1901, he purchased Carnegie Steel for $480 million, creating U.S. controlling two-thirds of American steel production. John solidified his dominance. 